There are two ways of adding secondary mailbox to Outlook 2016. The first way is by adding it as an additional account. The second way is by adding it as an additional mailbox. Adding it as an additional account will only work if you've been granted full permissions of the mailbox by the Exchange admin or if you have the password for the additional account that you're attempting to add. This method gives you more functionality and control over the secondary mailbox. Adding a mailbox as an additional mailbox is useful in situations where you've been given partial access of the mailbox or you don't have the password. To add it as an additional account, follow these following steps. Click on File, then click Add Account, then type in the email address of the account that you want to add. Then click Connect, then click Done. Now to add your secondary mailbox as an additional mailbox, do the following steps. Click on File, click on Account Settings, click on Account Settings again, click on Change, click on More Settings, click on Advanced, click Add. Then type in the email address of the mailbox that you're trying to add. and then hit OK. Hit OK again, hit Next, hit Finish. I also want to go over a couple advantages to adding the mailbox the first way as, a, as an additional account. So one of the advantages I'll show you here, it can be found if you go to Manage Rules and Alerts. So this is a place that you go to if you want to create rules. Rules like, I want all emails I receive to get filed in a specific folder. Or, I want all emails from a specific individual to automatically get deleted. So, these rules, you can not only add for yourself, but now, because you've added the mailbox as an additional account, you can add them for the secondary mailbox that you've set up as well and the rules that you add here will be totally separate from the rules that you add here. Another noteworthy advantage that you get from adding your mailbox this way is you get separate signatures for each account that you send an email from. And I'll show you here. So we'll go to File, Options, Mail, signature. So notice that you can select the email account that you want to modify the signature for. So I'm going to select my secondary mailbox and right now it has no signature but I can click on that and I can give it a totally different signature from my primary mailbox. Now when I go to send a new email, notice my signature here says personal signature, but if I click on from and change it to my secondary mailbox, the signature instead now says secondary signature. So that's just two of the many benefits that you get from adding your mailbox this way. And in an upcoming video, I'm going to show you some more features in Outlook 2016.